this computer. Hey, everybody. Welcome to our call tonight. My name is Michelle Stuchel, and I'm a Sapphire with Plexus. And that just means that I've helped a lot of people on their health and happiness journey. And I'm so glad that you've taken some time out of your busy schedule to join us to hear about why I chose Plexus and what it could do for you. And I can tell you 100% um, that this has been one of the best decisions of my entire life. Um, I will tell you well, okay. I want to start with this question. If your life, let me ask you this. If your life looked exactly the same in five years from now, as it does today, would you be okay with that? If your life was exactly the same 10 years from now, as it is today, would you be okay with that? Nothing changes, friends, if nothing changes. And the definition of insanity is doing the same thing and expecting different results. Now, fast, uh, let's rewind um, about six years. And I was a homeschooling mom of two kids with a toddler running around. I was supposed to be shining for Jesus in leadership, you know, doing all the right things. But inwardly, I was overwhelmed, exhausted, and basically just kind of motoring through life. I didn't have passion. I didn't have zeal. And in, in fact, I, I basically called, I thought I was being content, but it was basically just disappointment that was masked. Um, I never felt well. I had awful allergies, awful sinus infections, um, sleep apnea, digestive issues, PCOS, um, I have a whole health testimony. I got sick every time I would look at a germ and I never felt my best ever. I would pop pills constantly to sleep. I was always on allergy meds and it's not like there's anything awful or like crushing, but all the little things added up together. I just was living on fumes. I was living on coffee, living on tea. My kids knew when I was you know, jacked up on caffeine because I was happy and yelling at my kids was a normal part of our homeschool life um, and crazy hormones, PCOS. I was just not at the top of my game to say the least. If anything, it was, it was mediocre at best and really stuck in survival mode until plexus. And I had tried all sorts of things under the sun to try to feel better and nothing worked. Nothing gave lasting results until plexus. And my life really started to change. Um, and here's the thing. Uh, there was always something in me that hungered for more. There was something that like verses like this haunted me. I've come that you have life and life to the full. You know, the path of life leads upward for the wise. I will taste the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. You know, I'm going to forget what is behind and press on towards my upward call. You are the head and not the tail. And I believed that with all of my heart, but then I would look and it's not like, I, I mean, I had a great life, but there was still like this thing inside me that said that there had to be more. And I just kept putting it down. I kept putting it down. I wouldn't acknowledge it. I kept ignoring it because that's not what I was experiencing, right? I wasn't experiencing the more. We were a one-income family. My husband is a fabulous provider, um, you know, just a wonderful provider. And we didn't have needs. We were doing well, but we also have three girls. Um, we, you know, the day that we found out we were having another child, he opened the 529. We don't believe in debt. You know, girls are expensive. We like to travel. We like nice things. And we sacrificed a lot so I could be home with the kids because we wanted the most important things to stay the most important things. But in doing so, mom became my identity and I had stuffed a lot of my own dreams and passions and desires and basically was stuck in the grind of Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. If my husband happened to not work on Saturday, that was a bonus, but you know, many times he had to work on the weekends. And so it was just more of the same and then repeat more of the same and then repeat. Um, now, when I started the products, the products completely changed my life. I didn't know about gut health. I didn't know that gut health was, you know, most of the health issues that we deal in this country go back to the same issues of poor gut health, blood sugar imbalance, and inflammation. And that if you dealt with the, 
those things and address the root with best in class plant-based supplements, you can get your life back. So here I was 45 years old and all of a sudden I was feeling good. I was waking up rested. I um, was getting my life back. Um, I came off of all of my allergy meds and I, I just, I couldn't believe it. Like I thought, is this what I've been missing out on? Like, is this how most people feel? And I thought, if this is true, if, if all of these issues, if most of the health issues we deal with in, in this country go back to the same roots, why are we not shouting this from the rooftops? Now, Brittany, who's become one of my best friends, she's the one that introduced me to Plexus and she had cast vision to me, you know, that less than 2% of the population had heard the word Plexus, that we are at the bottom of the J curve before, you know, we become a legacy company like Mary Kay, because um, everybody will try Plexus at, at some point. Um, you know, we are at the cutting edge of science. We are the leading gut health company for the whole family. There's no other company doing what we're doing. And we have a monthly consumable that every man, woman, and child needs. So all of that from a strategic standpoint, a number standpoint, made perfect sense to me. Um, I could see that opportunity, but quite frankly, I didn't really want to be one of those people. And God surely wasn't going to answer my prayers through a network marketing company because I had done that before. I had tried it and I'd lost money. It didn't turn out. So why would this be any different? And I didn't understand. And I didn't understand that the company that you joined mattered, the team that you joined mattered. And I didn't understand what I had on my hands. So fast forward, I remember all these things were going through my mind and I remember I was thinking about it and I felt like the Lord said to me, Michelle, do you care more about helping people or more about what people think of you? And it stopped me dead in my tracks because of course I care about people, but I did care about what people thought of me. So I said, okay, yes, sir. People need to know. People need to know about these things. So I started sharing and I made almost $500 in my first month. And that began a journey for me. Um, I wish I would, you know, could say that I went full steam ahead, but I didn't. It was like one foot in, one foot out. And it began an incredible journey for me. Now, fast forward, April 7th, just a couple of days from now will be my six year anniversary. And let me share with, thank you. I will share with you what Plexus has done for me. And then I want to share, honestly, it doesn't really matter what it's done for me. This call is about you, but here's what it has done for me. I am now 50 years old and I look and feel better than I did in my thirties. I am, instead of living out of mediocrity and survival, I'm living out of purpose and mission. One of the most, you know, the uh, I've won trips. I've won, you know, I've been, I've taken last September, I took my husband to Hawaii on the company's dime. I've taken him to one of the top hundred resorts in America, in Mexico on the company's dime. I've earned a cruise trip to San Diego. I've been to Orlando, um, Vegas. I've earned three shopping sprees. And I'm not talking about a hundred dollars. I'm talking $2,500, $2,000 to $2,500 shopping sprees to Bloomingdale's and Nordstrom's. One of the best days ever. I'm serious. Um, iPads, MacBooks, Apple Watch. I mean, all the, all the things, right? Cash, incentives, um, fun. But what I never expected was the intangibles. And even though, and I'm earning a six-figure income, which is incredible. And it grew this year by five digits. Um, but what's been even greater than the financial success has been the intangibles. I mean, I never thought I needed more friends, but what I have gained is a priceless community of like-minded, growth-minded women that pull out my best, encourage me to grow and achieve more than I thought possible. I've learned and grown in ways that I never anticipated because in network marketing, if I want to grow my business, I have to grow myself as a person. I have become a better communicator. I've learned that I can have hard conversations with people and not die. I mean, that was a huge win for me because I did everything that I could to avoid hard conversations. I've become intentional and disciplined with my time. I've learned about habits, discipline, leadership, um, growing a healthy mindset. My marriage is stronger. My relationships are richer. And I can honestly say I'm a better wife, mom, and friend because of my network marketing business. My confidence has grown and I have grown in my identity in Christ. 
And most importantly, I've discovered that God absolutely has more for me. And I'm working and living out of a place of purpose, loving and serving other people. It's not all about me. It's about purpose and impact. And purpose and impact always involves other people. But here's the thing. As we develop our purpose and our and live out of our purpose and mission, you become blessed in the process. Because my heart is to, you know, I've discovered my mission because of this, that I encourage, equip, and launch people to go for the more that Jesus has. I raise up leaders that are doing the same, seeing people set free to be and do and have all that God has for them, changing lives physically and financially. I am living in a place of soul satisfaction like no other time in my entire life. I literally go to bed at night knowing that I'm living out the purpose, stewarding my gifts well, that he has for me, and I'm a part of helping other, others discover theirs. People's lives are being changed, both physically and financially, and I have a part in that. And I'm more alive and fulfilled because of what God has done in me through Plexus. And I'm so incredibly grateful. So when I say that Plexus has changed everything for me and my family, I mean it. And here's the thing. It can be for you too. It's not like I'm anything special. It's not like you have to be an extrovert because there's introverts. Some of the diamonds I respect the most are actually introverts. There's every Enneagram number. There's every personality type. There's every age. Here's the thing. To be successful in this business, you have to, you can have, have a willingness and a desire, you have to learn, be willing to take action and be willing to grow. And if you are those things, when I say the sky is the limit, it is. So why would you? Imagine, what if, going back to that first question I asked you, I mean, thinking about where you want to be in five years from now, okay? One of the reasons I love, I've come to absolutely love network marketing. And I used to kind of despise it. I thought it was kind of slimy, but I didn't understand it. I'd had a couple bad experiences, right? And so I very much in pride threw the whole industry out because of a couple bad experiences. But here's the thing. Have you ever been to a good restaurant? Anybody ever been to a good restaurant? You've all been to a restaurant, right? Great restaurant, great food, great service. Have you ever been to a bad restaurant? Bad food, bad service. Okay, well, let me ask you this. Did you stop going to restaurants because you had a bad experience? Absolutely not. You just decide what restaurants to go to. And what I found with Plexus, it's that this is the right company with the right products at the right time. And this is the right team to help you reach your goals. Here's the thing. It's not as if selling gut health supplements was my passion. But helping people be, do, and have all that God has for them is. And Plexus is the vehicle for that. Does your dream, let me ask you this. Does your dream include working with fabulous people that you get to choose. If you've ever worked in a toxic environment or had to work with people that you didn't really love, you know exactly how valuable this is because who you work with can change everything, right? Does your dream include residual income? Do you know what that means? It means that you can make money while you sleep. It means that you're building something that will have ramifications, exponential growth, and it's very different than being self-employed. If you're self-employed, if you don't work, you don't get paid. But when you're building with network marketing, you are building for residual income so that when you sleep, you are making money. I know people just a couple level, I mean, a couple levels up than me that are making crazy amounts of money, and they maybe work four hours a week if they want to. What if your dream, what if you were able to be quick, quickly profitable? I have friends that are that are entrepreneurial. They want to do, you know, they know that they're called to business. They're looking at franchises and they understand that they're not going to be profitable for three years. They're going to have debt. And yet I have people on my team last month were profitable. They joined and immediately were profitable because there's a low cost of entry and you can earn money back immediately. What about working on your own schedule? 
After COVID, when everybody had to work from home, what we found is that people wanted to work on their own time, on their own hours. People want freedom, right? We live in the land of the free, but so many people are slaves. You know what they're slaves to? Besides bad health and pills, they're slave to building somebody else's dreams. They're slave to working somebody else. They don't have time to enjoy their family. They don't have time to pursue their dreams. They don't have time to, to travel. They don't have time to be with their children. One of my dearest friends is at the top of the company. She was a teacher and she longed for a way to be able to be home because she missed all the important moments in her children's life, lives. And now she gives more each month than she used to make as a teacher. What if your job included recognition and incentive and prizes and fun? I can't tell you how many of those. I mentioned earlier what that has. I mean, how, how I've been able to achieve that, all of that. What it, does your dream include growing, learning, developing leaders, growing yourself, being paid to become a better human and a better wife and a better mom? What about, you know, leaving a legacy? Here, here's, here's where my sticky point comes. We were not born to pay bills and die. You were made for more. And so many of us settle for the grind of daily life when we could have so much more. Think about this, friends. If you, are, if you had all the resources to do what God's put in your heart and you had all the time in the world to do it, your calendar was completely empty. What would you be doing? What would your life look like? Would you be traveling with your kids? Would you be doing travel ball? Would you be going on missions trips? Would you be funding that orphanage in Haiti? What would you be doing? What would your life look like? What are you passionate about? Because here's the thing. Plexus can 100% be the vehicle for that. And I know it because I'm living it. And I see evidence of it all around. What do you want for your life? I'm telling you, don't squish or let your dream stay dormant. Because there's a reason why God's put those longings in your heart. Because he wants to do something. You were made for a purpose. You were made for passion. You were made for impact. You were made for more. And what if, maybe, maybe your dream is simply, I need to make $500 a month. Or I need to cover my car payment. Or I need to cover my mortgage. If I could just cover my mortgage, it would allow me to breathe. What, what if it was, okay, I just want $3,000 a month. If I could earn $3,000 a month, I, I don't have to worry or sweat when I think about summer and daycare and camps, or maybe it's $5,000 a month. Maybe it's $10,000 a month. Maybe it's complete financial freedom. Friend, I want to tell you all of it's possible because I have living proof all around me. It truly isn't a matter of does this work? but will you choose? So what does that mean? Does it, it means learning some new skills. It means being willing to get uncomfortable. It means being willing to learn and being willing to have an impact because that's what we're about. You know, if you choose Plexus, let me tell you what your job description is. Your job description is loving and serving people. And the more people you love and serve, the more your paycheck will grow. And if you do that, those things that are in your heart can absolutely come to pass. It's not a matter of will it or can it. It's not a matter of can it, but will you choose to do it? Do you know 95% of people that stay in network marketing for 10 years or longer, 95% of the people get to the top of their pay plan. The top of the pay plan on average in Plexus makes as much as a brain surgeon. 
Would you like to make multiple six figures a month? Not a bad, not a bad gig. Not a bad gig. And all along the way, earning $1,000 a month, $3,000 a month, $5,000 a month, $10,000 a month, $20,000 a month. Will it be work? Yes. Network marketing. What we do is work. But it's noble work. And the skills are simple that anybody can learn. So what could this mean for you? Friend, what do you want your life to look like in five years? What change do you want to see happen? Is it inwardly? Were you like me, stuck in mediocrity, stuck in the grind, stuck in survival, dreams buried? You want to feel alive, but really you're just living in this kind of status quo? Is it going to do more? Is it saying yes more to your children? Is it possibly to bring your husband home or to alleviate some of his stress and pressure of being the sole provider? Is it to take care of aging parents or to leave a legacy for your kids? What's your vision? Where do you want to be in five years? Because I can tell you where I am today versus where I was five years ago. I'm so grateful I said yes. I'm so grateful that God knew better than me. I'm so glad that God used a thing like network marketing to allow me to step into my purpose, impact, to bless my family, to change everything for us. And in doing so, change the trajectory for generations, not just of my family, but for so many others. Because I just said yes. And I know it can for you too. So here's the thing. You can look at me and my success and what so many of us have been able to achieve. And that's great. But the question is, friend, what do you want? Will you choose? Because it's not a matter of if this will work, but will you choose it too? And Plexus can absolutely be the vehicle for that whether it's to say yes to your family, yes to time freedom, yes to margin, yes to travel. It can be. You simply need to have the desire, the willingness, and take action. And I know it can. So think about those questions, friend. Where do you want to be in five years from now? Where do you want to be? What do you want? Because I can guarantee you, Plexus can be the vehicle for that because we have evidence all around. Don't settle for mediocrity. There's a quote that I love. It says, people don't know what they want and they're willing to go through hell to get it. Friend, I pray that that's not your story. I pray, I just, I want you, that's our heartbeat. I, we want you to be so soul satisfied so thrilled with what you're doing and going after the dreams that God's put in your heart that you go to bed at night, not exhausted out of burnout and overwhelm, but out of soul satisfaction, knowing that your path is leading upward, knowing that you're following your dream, knowing that you're having an impact because all of those things can be true. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule and joining us. Get back with the person that invited you to this call and see what this looks like. And we can't wait to see your Plexus journey unfold. Thanks, friends. <laughs>